Hi everybody, uh, today I want to show how to set up, how to, to put the, 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 the colors in the form to match uh, with your website. Normally we put uh, this style, black and white, with some grays, but if you put your form in your website, maybe you have a, a different colors like yellow or yellow or blue or you know something else. And today I want to show you uh, how how to to change these colors in in the form. For example, if I put I put my my form in this website, and this website have uh, a blue here and have uh, this kind of red and I want to change this bar and the gradients of all the form. I use one, one tool, it's a color Scylla to, to pick up the, the color of the website you can install in case you have Firefox or Chrome it's simple, I, like click in install color Scylla I already have it's here and I can use the color picker, I can use the CSS gradient generator or the gen uh, gradient generator you can you can access directly to the website here colorzilla.com uh, slash gradient uh, editor when you go to colorzilla you have two options to install the color picker and, and the gradient you can use uh, a different system to, to put the colors. Anyway, um, here in the admin panel, you have a front end tab. If you click, you have your own CSS style. Then, to know uh, what kind of cla class and what kind of ID we need to, to change, we go to the, the form, we click. In, for example, here let me put different way. Okay, if I click here, you see this division have a class called gradient. Then, if I want to put the same color of this blue, I can pick up the color and copy in clipboard then if I go to my CSS just put dot gradient background and save okay Now change this to the new blue we have in the website. Or if we want to put a little line, red line, like we have in the website, this, this red, we can go here and put the blue we have. Okay, another blue. Okay, this is the blue. Okay, and now this red is this one. We can put this red. For example, like this. Now we have a blue and red, and we click here in copy. We go to our CSS style and we change the background color for this one and save. Then you have this blue with the little red line much better with the website see blue, little red 
and I want to change this red too. This is uh, let me do here. Sorry, here. This is uh, called daily language. Okay, we go here. The ID is with this and background, and we put the red we have. This red like this save now we have a similar color this red with the same blue and the little red line we can also put a more dark if we want the oh for example okay this is these boxes have uh, is uh, class border 3 well, let me check the same color border 3 Put uh, three border three pixel solid and the color save. Now we have. the border with the same red color you can do in any part of this form you can change the, the CSS if you want to put uh, a background in black or sample if I want to put this in, in gray like this just go to the CSS we have here some sample. This one, for example, copy this. Go to border three, and we paste. Save. And now the form have a nice gray. You see from here to here, you can change the color of the, the, the font, you can do anything you want with your own CSS uh, uh, style in the tab, in this tab, in front end tab. Well, I see you in the next video, and I want to explain or I want to do an overview of the full system. Thank you very much for your attention, and I see you soon. Bye.